Hey Capricorn, welcome to your reading for the month of July 2024. Please be sure to just take what resonates and leave what doesn't. You guys are going to be figuring out of like maybe some sort of lie that was kind of like told about you guys as well. And it feels like even going back to address the situation, but it feels like the more that you try to maybe like plead your case, the less people will like believe you. So it kind of just gives a sense of like watching everything unfold in the distance and just allow something to pretty much take its course because eventually something is going to die out. And I feel like people are going to realize that this person was not necessarily being truthful to you guys truthful about you guys or to you guys as well so it, it just feels like something is just not worth replying to something is not worth going back to because it feels like you guys are actually going to be doing very well for yourself or entering a period where a lot of things are actually coming your way it just kind of feels like you're going to have someone that definitely tries to like rain on your parade in some sense or try to make you feel just try to pull you back into like unnecessary drama because it kind of feels like people will be hitting you up or like calling your phone letting you know like hey like do you know what such and such is saying about you or like did you see like see this post about you in some sense as well and i automatically got the sense of it making you very angry because it's like why would they do that or like why would they say that you know like i've always tried to like maybe be there for them i try to like help them as well for some of you guys someone is claiming that you put hands on them Okay, someone is claiming that you maybe like abuse them in some way as well. And it is just very disgusting and like not true. I definitely feel like there is maybe family that even like gets involved as well or someone that comes to your side to defend you. This could also be like a sister if that resonates as well because it just feels like someone is so unhappy at the fact that you guys are moving away from them or like you guys are like I guess like living your best life in some way that they are going to try to ruin or tarnish like your reputation in some way and it, it just kind of feels like they take they took something way too far and it ends up like you guys end up losing a whole lot of respect for them because of the fact as well and there could have maybe been like a potential of reconciling in a sense of like we can make maybe like be friends in some way as well but now you out here telling people that i put hands on you or like i abused you in some sense as well so um it, it just kind of feels like you guys are going to be cutting complete contact with this person or no longer getting involved with this person and it really does feel like like for your own safety and for some of you guys you guys could be masculines that are also like um watching this in some sense it just feels like something that you you guys are not going to want to like get involved in um as well it kind of feels like if people ask you about it you're just going to be like no that's not true and just like keep it pushing to be honest but for the most part i don't really it's like if you just don't react to be honest because whatever lie that this is it just feels like the more silent that you guys are the less people will also like believe it in some way as well and there's even like maybe something about like text messages um that could be like very significant because I honestly feel like this person was just very jealous or like envious of you in some sense or like they they wanted what you guys had in some way and for some of you guys there could have maybe been like a third party that you guys could have went to or chosen over this person um as well and it kind of feels like you guys could have tried to hey like i just want i just wanted to like let you let you know like it, it's, it's something about that like you're trying to let this person down easily but like they didn't want to take it so like they ended up making up some sort of like really big lie about you in some sense as well like i don't know like I, I feel like someone is just having trouble like maybe coming to terms with something that could have ended even though if you guys try to like be nice about it or again like let them down easy but i feel like you guys did the right thing in like moving away from this individual because it feels like they could have also maybe tried to like trap you or like they wanted to try to like trap you as well like this person is coming through as a bit like insane um as well so you guys did the right thing to move away again i feel like you guys are coming into like maybe like a lot of growth or things are finally looking up for you like honestly like i feel like you guys are entering some sort of like new chapter 10 10 could also like be significant for you because it feels like you guys could have also been like maybe in like a dark period or a space where everything was like really still but it's like you kept on dealing with like an energy that didn't want to like either like let you go or that was continuously nagging at you in some sense as well and it just kind of feels like you're finally going to be able to like move away from it it kind of feels like this person did not want you to get too far away um as well which is why they could have also tried to sabotage some of the things that you guys could have gotten into or got for yourselves as well it gives a sense of if you guys were living with this person it kind of feels like they were also hiding like certain mails or like documents as well and it wasn't until you guys gotten like an email or like a call and it's like no i never received it and it's like yeah i sent this like weeks ago and it's like you go looking for it and you end up finding it in like this person's stash or like 
like in the garbage or something like that as well and you were you just kind of came to that realization that this person was trying their best to kind of sabotage whatever opportunity that was like um coming towards you guys um as well some of you guys could also like be living with family if that resonates but i do feel like you guys are going to be finding yourself like in a much better position and it feels like this whatever attempt that someone is going to try to tarnish your reputation like your image in some sense it kind of feels like a last attempt um to do so um in some sense as well but after this it doesn't really feel like you guys are going to be hearing from this person or um connecting with this person at all it, it again feels like you guys do the right thing of like moving away there could be something that you guys are like pouring into or doing for yourselves i feel like you guys are going to be finding a lot of reassurance when it comes to it you guys are going in the right direction or like taking the right steps as well and it could have also been something that you guys have always wanted to do but you guys were necessarily like unable to do so because it feels like some of you guys could have also been taking care of someone there is something about a loss that is here maybe like a death in like the family or like the loss of like a loved one and it feels like because like you guys were maybe like taking care of them um or whichever or like making sure that someone was all right you were unable to go and pursue like certain things as well but they definitely did not want you to kind of like stop what you guys were doing or yeah like something about like your education could have also like been very significant and it feels like it's what they could have like wanted for you um in some sense or this could be a thing of like you guys being too scared to leave their side because you feel like if they leave their if you leave their side like then they're just going to like be gone in some sense as well there's something about that that is coming through and for those of you who may resonate it feels like you may end up like losing like this person um as well and you're going it feels like you guys could end up like harboring like a lot of guilt in regards to it because it's like oh if i if, if i just like stayed there if i if i like um did not leave their side then maybe like this wouldn't have happened like in the first place as well and blaming yourself is not going to do anything it feels like you guys did exactly what they wanted you to do and that that means like in terms of like living your life or like going after like what it is that you want because at the end of the day like you have a life of your own to live like i already knew that my time was coming in some sense however that may resonate for you guys as well but you guys are being guided to just continue keeping a strong um head on your shoulders and to also know that something is not your fault because there's a feel of like you guys reappearing into some sort of scene um if this is like the loss of like a loved one in some sense however that may resonate for you it's like you guys come back to like the family or whichever for some sort of like funeral um of some sort or whichever and it kind of feels like everyone's maybe like fighting or attacking each other and it's like it's your fault it's like if you didn't leave or again like this person could also be pretty young if that resonates and it kind of feels like something that could have just been like a complete accident um as well but it's like oh it's your fault they were following like in your footsteps when you were actually trying to get out of like whatever bad like situation that this was or yeah especially if like you were getting into things that wasn't necessarily good and it kind of feels like you had like younger siblings or cousins or whichever that were kind of like following you in some sense and you were trying to tell them like no that's not the way or whichever um as well it, it just kind of feels like wrong place wrong time if that resonates but it kind of feels like it's very sudden um in some sense as well and it feels like because yeah like someone's going to try to not welcome you back into something because they feel like it's your fault and it's like maybe that they could have been like their only like son or whichever however that may resonate daughter um for you guys as well and i feel like that may also like add to like your guilt in some sense as well and it's like you feel like a lot of shame in some sense and there's there could even be a sense of someone wanting to like get like some sort of like revenge however that may resonate but i feel like you guys are being guided to not let like that hate fill your heart um as well because there's a sense of you guys not being able to like see certain things clearly or again like not letting like, that grief also fill your heart because i feel like this moment is going to pass where you know like everyone's just dealing with like such a hard time everyone is having a like issues kind of like i guess um grieving with the situation and they're all dealing with like it differently in some sense and so like you may feel like very outcasted but it's like there's going to be someone that like rec recognizes or realizes like you know like that's not right for them to say that in some sense and it's like we know that it wasn't your fault it just kind of feels like everyone was dealing with like a very emotional moment um as well but like we know it wasn't your fault and we would love to also like have you guys back as well so there is a sense of like reuniting with like your loved ones or those that you guys were um very close with um if that resonates as well right yeah but it feels like you guys are going to be trying your best to maybe like move past something as well and it, it just kind of feels like <sighs> something coming to like a complete pause because of like whatever situation whatever ending and it's like, how do I continue like living or continue kind of like 
trying to get back to a normal routine after experiencing what I've experienced or going through like this loss um, in some sense as well. And it kind of feels like, you know, like I don't really know how I'm doing it, but I'm managing to also do so as well. And again, like it's coming through as like it's what they would have wanted um, in some sense. But it feels like there is going to be someone that completely turns their life around as a result of this um, as well. There could also be something about like fear that is there, but um, I feel like something is coming through as being a wake-up call for another person um, as well, right? But you guys are, again, being guided to not blame yourself for something. And there is a situation that you guys are going to be coming out of. There's going to be individuals that feel like you guys have changed. You're like, you guys are so different now um, in some sense. And they even may try to kind of, like, make fun of you for it. But it's like, you know, like, it's all fun and games now. But, like, you know, like a couple years down the line, you guys are going to be wishing that you guys have done the same thing um, in some sense as well and it's like you do have a point um as well because it's like you know like we're all getting older at the end of the day and it's like i can't just sit here and sit in the routine of like i'm going to do this i'm going to do that and i'm not actually taking any action um as well because it kind of feels like linking up um well, like the same group of friends or like being around like the same group of people and it's like we're all talking about what we're going to do with our lives but it's like no one is actually kind of like taking that necessary action in some sense as well so you may have been like the first to break out of some sort of like ongoing loop in some sense as well or it's like I got the image for someone who could have like maybe indulged or like maybe smokes a lot in some sense as well like it, it kind of feels like very much being stuck in like their comfort zone in some sense and it's like there's not really like a an authoritative figure that is helping to kind of like maybe push this person out of it because it feels like this person could live with like their parents in some sense or they live under someone because it there it just comes to like being very comfortable like um I, again like this is someone who's coming through like very much indulging like i've seen someone who's like pretty much just high and just like laying in bed and it's like the same thing the only time I, that i'm getting up is to get up and smoke eat and then like lay back down um pretty much is how that's coming through but someone is going to receive like some sort of wake-up call to break out of like that habit some of you guys could have really tried to maybe help this person in some sense as well and i feel like seeing how much you guys have like grown or seeing how like you guys could have stopped doing things or getting into like certain things is going to make this person feel like a bit ashamed because it's like I wish I could do the same or I wish like I could do that and they could but for whatever reason they feel like they are unable to so you guys could also have someone close to you that you guys could have really tried to guide and like in the right direction that feels as though like they're sinking deeper and deeper into some sort of hole as well and I feel like the things that they are also getting into is also kind of like um showing that as well and it's like it, it kind of sucks because it feels like there could be something that ends up happening like to this person and it's like you guys again like you guys could have really cared about them but it's like I can't really help them if they do not want to help themselves and you guys may again feel like some sort of guilt when it comes to that as well but it's like there's nothing that you guys could have really done within the situation um as well I feel like I don't know like there's something about like being around you could have also like really made them feel bad about like where they were or like where they were going they felt like they didn't really have like the energy or like the power to lift themselves up the way that you guys did and it kind of feels like their surroundings was like um a very big um part of that as well like it's like you guys could have only done so much some of you guys could like be like a mentor or a teacher um in some sort or like a personal coach in some sense as well but it's like I, as like a personal coach or a mentor in some sense, there was only so much that I could do where they were in terms of like maybe like their living situation or like their parental figures could have also played like a very big part in that. And if like if their parentals or whoever it is that they're around are not also like pushing this person to be like the best that they can be, then you know, like, the, it kind of feels like, you know, like, the child was almost already, like, doomed from the start in some sense as well. And again, it just gives a sense of like not really having like good people around them is how that's coming through because again like this person is coming through is like just getting into like the same the same exact things to be honest um and it's not really helping them people could be around this person seeing like how this person is doing like where this person is going but none of them are like reaching out a hand and now it's like when something like happens or something ends up going wrong no one is knowing like what to do or whose fault it was in some sense but it's like you were you were watching this person up close and personal ruined their lives and you guys chose not to say anything about it so you're all to blame is exactly how that's coming through to be honest right um 
I don't even feel like you guys are going to want anything to do with like these people because again like this could have been like a circle that you guys could have all like maybe been involved in at one point but it's like there could be something specific that ends up happening that kind of tears you apart from them and you're not going to want anything to do with these people you're just not going to want anything to do with these people because yeah i don't even know what to say it's kind of like i wasn't even like really around a lot of the time you guys were the ones that were really around this person to kind of like watch this person it's like yeah you could have talked like here and there but at the same time you were also enabling this person whether you realize it or not and that's how it's coming through there could be something about like addiction that is very much coming through when it comes to this um as well so it's like i just don't want to really be involved with you guys or i don't want to like really be involved with you guys as well and it feels completely understandable you guys are just going to be coming through as like living a separate life of your own compared to like whatever these people may have going on like there's a huge disconnect that is there huge disconnect like you guys will not be speaking or you guys will probably never speak to them again or never kind of like come in contact with them again um i just get the image of like a lot of people kind of like losing certain things i feel like loss is a heavy thing that could be like within this for whatever reason and it doesn't necessarily like i do feel like you guys may be going through some sort of loss of course from what i mentioned like um previously before all of this as well but I feel like it has to do with the people that you guys like have connected to. It it just feels like completely living living different lives as well. And there could be a thing of you guys being a bit hard to relate to because you guys have managed to get yourself out. This could also be in terms of like um moving away from like a very bad neighborhood as well. Like you guys were one of the people or the main person to manage to actually escape something. So I feel like people are going to maybe have a hard time relating to you if you guys are, um, if they are still in like that same position, like there's nothing to really speak about. I feel like you guys are going to have so much to speak about in some sense in terms of like your life, but when it comes to them, they won't really have much. So it's like they're just sitting there and listening, but they're not really saying much as well. And they can't help but really feel a certain type of way or almost feel as though like, you're rubbing it in their face because nothing much has changed for them. But it's also like they never chose to actually take that initiative to create a certain change for themselves. Yeah. Yeah. But I, I do pick up on a bit of sadness that it's here because it, it kind of feels like it's breaking my heart that I have to kind of like turn away from like these people or like this situation. But it's like, what more that I could do at the same time? And yeah, it, it feels like it's going, it's not going to be easy. It feels like it's going to be very difficult, but it's like, there's nothing that you guys can do at the end of the day. And it feels like it's something, it's going to be very hard because it's something that you guys have to do. Because you would be prolonging like your own healing or it's like you cannot spend a lot of your time being worried about someone or worried about like where someone is going when you have your own things or your own life that you have yet to kind of like figure it out or you're in the midst of figuring out for yourself. It's like you can't really help anyone unless like you help yourself first. And it's a situation where you guys are basically having to put yourself first. Because at the end of the day, someone is going through like their own sets of like life lessons in some way as well. You guys have already learned a lot of yours or you guys are nearing learning a lot of your own life lessons as well. But you're not going to be able to pull yourself um, to pull somebody out of something without pulling yourself into what they have going on. It's like I can see you guys ending up back in a situation it won't happen but it's like let's say like you guys end up back in a situation and it's like well at least you're able to help this person at least you're able to kind of like be there for this person now and try to guide this person in the right direction but it's like at what cost because you guys could have been in a completely different direction in life going to where you are meant to be going but because of like i don't know something going left you ended up back at where you guys had to be undoing a lot of the hard work that you guys have done in the first place to reach a certain point. And it's not going to be worth it. It's not going to be worth it. Because I can see you guys maybe getting back out of that situation. But because you guys are no longer with that person or near that person, all of the hard work that you have done to get them to a certain point or to realize certain things 
all of that begins to come undone and they end up right back in the same situation. There could be something that is very specific about like someone's past lives that could be coming through and you guys could have had a past life together. Now I'm starting to realize it and think about this now. You guys could have had a past life together where you guys were always together and you and because you guys were always with them, you had them kind of avoid certain things. In certain in a certain lifetime, you guys were not with this person and they ended up going back down a wrong path. In this lifetime, it kind of feels like maybe like repeating itself in a sense, but it's it's like their soul or higher self or whichever, they have to kind of go through it. But it's very crazy. So just take what residency even doesn't. But the next lifetime is going to be a bit easier on them. Because their soul is going to recognize some sort of pattern in some sense as well. You couldn't follow them throughout all of these other lifetimes to be able to save them from something. Because at the end of the day, again, this person is going to have to go through certain life lessons on their own. So the first couple of lifetimes that you guys could have already had with them, you've helped them out. You've gotten them out of certain situations. The last two lifetimes, including this one being one of them, they were not able to make it out because of the fact that you guys, you guys have your own thing that you guys had to kind of go through. So it, it kind of feels like it's repeating itself in that sense. Yeah. Okay. I'm just going to leave. Um, I think I'm just going to kind of like leave that there. But I feel like this could have been very heavy for someone as well. Or like you may maybe realize hopefully this resonates. But um, thank you guys so much for watching. I do hope that all of this resonates for you guys as well. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.